ready for our nursery rhymes today? Let's start by singing Humpty Dumpty. Humpty Dumpty sat on a wall. Humpty Dumpty had a great fall. All the king's horses and all the king's men couldn't put Humpty together again. Well, Humpty Dumpty is back on his wall. But somebody else is missing. Have a little look in our garden and see if you can work out who we're going to sing about next. Yes, it's Bar Bar Black Sheep. Ready? Bar Bar Black Sheep, have you any wool? Yes, sir, yes, sir, three bags full. One for the master and one for the dame and one for the little boy who lives down the lane. Would you like to help me sing it this time? Are you ready? Baba Black Sheep, have you any wool? Yes sir, yes sir, three bags full. One for the master, one for the dame and one for the little boy who lives down the lane. Dragon is back again to help us play our odd one out game. So today we are looking for the word that does not rhyme with the other two. That's the word that has a different sound at the end. Dragon, are you going to get out of your wagon? So let's see what we have today. We have B, leg, tree. That's B, leg, tree. Which word has a different sound at the end? Dragon, do you know? Have a look. What do you think? Leg. Do you agree with Dragon? Do you think leg has a different sound at the end? Let's think. We've got B and tree. They have an E sound at the end. And you're right, Dragon, because leg has an egg at the end, doesn't it? Well done. Should we do another one? Let's see what we have now. We have goat, carrot and parrot. That's goat, carrot, parrot. Which two words rhyme and which one is the odd one out? Dragon, which one is the odd one out? Goat. That's right, dragon, isn't it? Goat is the odd one out because carrot and parrot rhyme. No, no parrot, we didn't call you. We were talking about rhyming words and talking about parrot and carrot rhyming. We didn't say parrot with a carrot, but okay, bye bye. Let's play our move into the beat game. Today, I want you to be an angry giant stomp him. If I play my castanet and a horse trotting, if you hear me play my wooden instrument. Let's have a go. Are you ready? Are you stomping angrily like a giant? Can I see you trotting like a horse? That was much quicker, wasn't it? Let's do it again. Well done. back. Hello Chef Pickles. Hello everybody. Have you come to help us make some more stew? Yes. Shall we sing our song? What shall I do? What shall I do? I want to make some pretend stew. Put in a toy dog. 
What shall I do? What shall I do? I want to make some pretend stew. Put in a frog. So, can you remember what we put in so far? We put in a dog and a frog. What shall I do? What shall I do? I want to make some pretend stew. Put in a log. Shall we see what we've put into our pot? We've put in a log, a frog, and a toy dog. Do you notice something special about those words? Log, frog and dog. They all rhyme. They all have og at the end. Listen carefully and see if you can hear the og sound. Log, frog, dog. Should we put them back in the pot now? In goes the dog. In goes the frog and in goes the log. Our stew should soon be ready but remember we've made pretend stew and all the things we've used are just toys. It's time for us to play with words again. So today I have a cat and I have a rabbit. Let's clap the word cat and find out how many parts it's got. Cat! How many claps did I do? One. It has one clap or just one syllable. Let's try with rabbit. Rabbit! How many claps? Two. It has two parts or two syllables. Your turn now. Let's try and clap cat. Cat! And let's try and clap rabbit. Rabbit. Let's play the game where I clap but not say the names and you try to guess what they are. You ready? Yes, it was rabbit. Rabbit. Let's try again. That was cat, wasn't it? Listen again. That was rabbit. Cat. It's time for our game of I Spy. So let's see which objects we have today. We have mouse, log, bat. I spy with my little eye something that rhymes with frog. Is it mouse, log, bat? Let's have a little think. Mouse, frog. Does that have the same ending? Log, frog. Hmm, I can hear og in log and frog. Bat, frog. Which one do you think rhymes? I think log and frog have the same ending, so they rhyme. We come to the end of today's program, but we hope we, you've had lots of fun and you've learned lots of new things about rhyming. But until we meet again, it's bye-bye from all of us.